it's like two weeks delayed is because I made it the first time and it was way too long and I absolutely, I absolutely despise editing. So I'm just going to redo it. Um, I'm going to have it in categories of clothing, accessories, makeup, and then maybe souvenirs, but we'll see because you guys probably aren't even interested in souvenirs anyways. So if you guys only want to go see a certain part of it, then you can fast forward certain areas and see. Also the lighting really sucks because I have a lamp on me and it has like, a, it gives me a yellowy tinge or something and outside it's like 6 o'clock, so yeah. Um, okay, so let's just get started. Um, last time I realized it was way too long because I would always describe the clothing, but you guys can see it, so I'm not going to describe it. So this one is this, <laughs> here and here I'm just going to describe it, no. Um, yeah, this one's just really long. Maybe I'll hold it up to my body. You guys can all see these in the outfits the days to come. Um, I also have no price tags on them because I've been wearing them. This one is actually see-through-ish, so you need a tank top underneath, but it's just the lace, which I am in love with. I'm going to obviously describe things that you couldn't be able to tell by just looking at it. Like this one has a weird neck and it's kind of like an off the shoulder scoopy kind of thing. Cruise through this one, hopefully. This one again. It's like the see through material. So you wear a tank top under this one too. And I found all their clothing was really long there. So I didn't get a whole lot. And we also didn't have a lot of time because we were sightseeing. And I didn't get any jeans because um, they were all really high-waisted and they just fit me really funny, so yeah. Do -do -do -do. You guys will be able to see what all these look like on me because you know how often I do outfits of the days and I will show all these in outfits of the days to come, so worry not. This one I haven't worn out yet because this one's more fancier. It still has the tag on it. But this one, <coughs> oh yuck, sneezed all over myself. <laughs> Anyways, um, I just love the color of this one. All mine are like, have the baggy top kind of feel so far. I don't know, I'm just loving those right now. I love the off the shoulders. This one too, it's like the off the shoulder with the boat. These are my only pair of jeans I got because I only brought one pair and they're really, no one wears shorts there, everyone wears jeans which like is amazing since it was like 40 degrees it felt like with humidity. Um, but when we went to Shanghai I just went with my mom and my brothers are so protective over us because I have three older ones so um, they were all like oh well you don't want to stand out and you don't want to seem like a tourist because I'm Asian so I blend in kind of. So they're like, well, wear jeans, blah, 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 and like, don't wear your shorts, because they're pretty short compared to the jeans there, or the shorts there. So I just got some gray jeans, straight leg. They fit really weird, though, but, oh well. What you gonna do? I found it really hard to buy jeans there. Um, and then this one is just a cardigan. My mom actually bought this for herself and didn't like how it looked on her, so I got it. And then I got these fun. Um, this one, see it looks really weird because the way it was designed is it has this extra like little oomph here and you, this goes like right, this goes on your waist and then it like sits out here, but you guys will see when I wear it actually on. But I really love the v-neck and like, you know, off the shouldery, big sleeves. Love it. And it's super lightweight and comfy. This one I've worn on like vlog TV or something. You guys really liked it. Um, but yeah, it's just longer and off the shouldery again. Seriously, like all the shirts I got were off the shoulder. Because I love that style nowadays. And then this is the only dress I got. It's just a simple black, roughly, it's got the ruffles and the button detail down the middle, and then the band at the waist, and it's like just really lightweight and cute and flirty for summer and stuff like that, 
and then you can tie it around a halter around your neck if you want. But yeah, this one was cute. This one was super cheap. I can't remember exactly, but it was like $10 maybe, 15 Canadian dollars. So that was good. Good for party. And remembering correctly, that's all the clothes I got. Yeah, so I told you it wasn't a whole lot for being there for a month. Just totally fine. Oh, I got some shoes, but they're just Lacoste shoes that are like simple white. They're not flats or heels. They're not, and they're not skater shoes. They're like, you know how those Adidas shell toes shoes look? Um, they're just kind of like that. I'll show you in an outfit of the day or something, but they're just out by the front door and everything, so I don't want to grab them. But okay, so I got three purses. And I rock at bartering, so I got them all for $15, and like lowered the price more than half, so I was pretty proud. Um, this is the first one, um, really big, cream colored, which I'm absolutely loving. Um, I got this because I thought it would be great for school, because it's so flippin' huge, and it has like a nice, oops, a nice little divider. I already have crap in there, even though I haven't used it yet. Um, yeah, so that's really good and big for school, but I'm like, I'm just going to wear it all the time anyways, because I love it. And then this one I definitely got mainly just for school, because the compartments are phenomenal. So it's really just simple. I stuck with simple colors, so, you know, it won't go out of style, and it'll match everything. This one has, um, one huge compartment right here. And then another huge compartment right here, and this thing in the middle, a little divider, which I thought was perfect for, like, one side's my laptop and one side's my notes and stuff, or textbook or something. So, so yeah, I absolutely love that. It has great, great compartments, and, like, a lot of zippered sides and stuff for your phone. And then it has a zipper here for, like, I don't know, whatever you want. Whatever your heart desires. So, yeah. And it has like um, twisted arm bandy things. <laughs> I don't know. Um, I suck at describing things. Okay, and then my other last purse I got is the one I'm using now. And I mainly am using it now because it was the one I was planning on using for carry on because it's so flippin' huge. Um, and it's, you guys know how much crap I carry, so it's overstuffed. But this one is beyond ginormous. It has the huge middle pocket, which is zippered and super deep. Like, I just have a bunch of crap in it. And then it has one on both sides that are just as big and deep. There's that one and that one. So, of course, it's perfect for me because I carry my life in my bag. Literally. <laughs> and I didn't get any of those fake knockoff bags because they were really obviously fake, so... Oh, it just wasn't my style. But yeah. I just think it's just good for summer. So I'm already past the 10 minute mark, so I'm going to stop here and let you guys... And I'll link you to the second part of the video, which will be accessories, makeup, and perhaps souvenirs. So thank you so much for watching part one. Stay tuned for part two.